Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix Assassin's Creed Shadows DX12 error. First of all, you want to go ahead and check your system requirements. So you can do this on Steam or anywhere you uh, bought the game. Now, if everything is fine, you want to go ahead and update your drivers. So for example, I use NVIDIA for that. Uh, if you have an AMD Radeon, you want to open up that application. And here on drivers, you can download the latest drivers. What you also want to go ahead and do is open up settings. On settings, you want to click system, then go to storage, temporarily files, and delete uh, DirectX shader catch. So you want to go ahead and delete this one. You also want to go ahead and check your uh, DirectX uh, version. So you want to open up search bar, write down run. On run, you want to write down DXDX. So it's like a uh, diagnostics. So DX Diag, uh, click OK. Now it will basically open up and do a direct X diagnostic for you. And you need to have a direct X 12 version for it, for this game. Now what you also want to try, if you use Ubisoft, uh, then you're going to write on Ubisoft Connect and run it as administrator. If you use Steam for the game, you're going to do the same for it too. Now you also want to go ahead and run AC Shadows as administrator. So for example, uh, if you have it on Ubisoft, you're going to open up here. After that, you're going to click on the game, uh, then go to Manage, Properties, and Installation. And you want to open up where the game is. You want to go ahead and find the .exe file and then go ahead and run it as administrator. See if the problem was fixed or not. Another thing to try out is run the game in DX11. So you're going to click on the game, go to manage properties. And here you will see add launch error arguments. So you want to write down um, dash DX11. If that didn't work, you want to write down DX12 instead of 11 and see if the problem was fixed or not. Uh, on Steam, it's basically the same. You're going to go to the game properties and here you will see launch options. So you're just going to write down DX11. You also want to go ahead and verify the game files. You can do this on Ubisoft Connect too. Um, but on Steam, it would be go on the game properties, install files and verify integrity of the game files. On Ubisoft, you just click on the game, uh, click manage and verify the files. Now, if none of those worked, you want to go ahead and search for control panel, open it. Uh, then you want to go ahead and find hardware and sound. So just make sure to be on the category. Click right there. Then you will see power options. Click on it. And on power options, you can go ahead and choose high performance or ultimate per performance. It depends on what you see here. But instead of balance, you're going to choose a higher option. If that didn't work, you want to set AC Shadows to use high performance GPU. So you can do this by going on graphics settings, just right down on the search bar. Uh, then you will see it here and you want to go ahead and add a desktop app. So you want to add AC Shadows exe file here. And after that, you're going to click on it and you want to go ahead and choose high performance NVIDIA. Uh, or not NVIDIA, uh, GPU. Another thing to try is disable all overlays. So like uh, Discord overlay, Ubisoft Connect overlay, uh, even Steam overlay and MSI Afterburner. You can also go ahead and turn it off. Riva Turner, try all of those things. And that should also fix the problem because this works for a lot of people. And now the last thing I recommend to do just go ahead on your browser and write down DirectX uh, Microsoft and just go ahead and download the latest uh, version. And that should also fix your problem. So if this video was helpful, guys, make sure to subscribe to this channel and I will see you next time.